my grip is choking the ball. All right, my thumb always came a little bit under in order to try to match this this uh, middle finger, and that's where I would get my strength in my hand in order to pull down with. And I would really have the curve here. A lot of pitchers throw with the all the straight part of the of the horseshoe. I used to get it on the curve of the horseshoe, and that curve allowed me to get my my thumb to the seam here, and that's what really created the leverage and the power that I needed in my fingers in order to really get good spin. I never could really understand this drill. Right, because in reality, the ball is not even in my hand. It's on the fingertips, and I'm doing this. But I always felt that my tips of my fingers were the reason this ball broke. And if you just do that and squeeze your fingers correctly, I kind of loosen up in the back end and let the tips of the fingers be the driving force, and then you get the natural break there. That, that was something that I can now convey to pitchers so they can feel that's how you really want that curveball to come out of your hand.